At the Dane County Regional Airport, they're getting ready for whatever the storm brings. As Dave Delosier tells us, they spent today making sure they're ready for whatever comes. It's looking great. You know, a Monday is a great day for us always. It's always busy. And for travelers, seeing this always makes it a better day. We are going to Auckland, New Zealand today. Which will take Julie Gabris about as far away as you can get from this. A winter storm warning is in effect north of a line from Darlington to Madison to Sheboygan. I want you guys safe. The winter storm that rolled through Denver today is heading our way, but coming with it, a lot of questions. I think it's the uncertainty. Um, nobody seems to know how bad it's going to be, or are we going to get rain? Are we going to get snow? Is it going to be a lot of snow? The challenge for the airport is to prepare for weather that seems to be a moving target. Today is our day to plan, you know, to make sure that our plan is in place, make sure we know what the weather service is anticipating. That means having snow and ice removal equipment ready and crews in place to deal with whatever the storm brings. While the airport prepares for whatever this storm might bring, the message from the airlines is simple. If you don't have to travel tomorrow, don't. All of our airlines, at least locally, have put in a travel waiver, which means if you don't need to travel on Tuesday or Wednesday, you can change your flight either today, of course, or go out Thursday or Friday. So if your travel plans are flexible, that would be a great idea. Already, some flights to and from Denver have felt the impact of the storm, a storm that brings some uncertainty and flight schedules that just might join it. Best advice if you must fly tomorrow is to check your flight status before coming to the airport at your airline's website at the Dane County Regional Airport website or sign up for free alerts with your airline. At the Dane County Regional Airport, this is Dave Delosier, WISC News 3. All right, Dave, thank you. And Frontier Airlines already has canceled flights from Denver to Madison today and their flight to Denver tomorrow.